see an airbag for a bullet? This device designed here in San Diego could change the conversation on the use of force by police. 10 News has confirmed that local trainers were in Ferguson, Missouri today as police began learning how to use it. And 10 News reporter Michael Chen joins us. Michael, some believe this could save a lot of lives. They do, and the concept is a fairly simple one. An orange attachment is actually put on a gun, and when the bullet is fired, it actually melds with a device the size of a ping pong ball and becomes less lethal. In San Diego and across the country, protesters marched the streets after a Ferguson police officer shot an unarmed black teen. In the wake of the incident, Ferguson police have turned to a product from Poway company Alternative Ballistics. Within seconds, is easily mounted to the top of the weapon. Meet the Alternative, a handgun attachment that can be put on quickly. The bullet that's fired combines with a device the size of a ping pong ball, making it less lethal. Company founder Christian Ellis. It's between a bullet and a bean bag on the kinetic energy, so it is going to break some ribs. Consider it like an airbag for a bullet. Ellis spoke to us from Ferguson after wrapping up a training with a group of officers there. He says Ferguson police have purchased devices for the entire force. If you ask a police officer what are their options in lethal force situations, they're going to say their gun and their bullets. This gives them another option. Critics have taken aim at the time required to attach the device. Moments that could place an officer's life in danger. If you have to get it out of a holder, you're talking several seconds, and by that time, you are already dead. Drop it! Ellis says the attachment is not designed for those immediate danger situations. Instead, you may have a mentally unstable person with a knife that is pacing back and forth. This gives the officer the ability to keep the distance that the other less lethals don't provide them. In other words, a taser requires officers be relatively close to the person. The alternative does not. In a statement, Ferguson police say they have yet to approve the full use of these devices for their 55 member force. Meanwhile, the Poway company says they've already received orders for the $45 attachment from agencies in Mexico and South Africa. Michael Chen, 10 News.